Good morning and happy 2021. We are so excited to leave 2020 in the past and look forward to the hope of the future. We get all of our hope from Jesus. But this is always kind of a sad time of year for me, even though there's so much hope and new beginnings, because I have to undecorate for Christmas. And maybe you have this feeling too. You start to take all the tinsel off of the tree, and you start to take down all the lights, and the Christmas tree goes back in the bag or the box, and it has to go somewhere. And suddenly, our houses just feel normal. In fact, sometimes they feel boring or sad. And we have to kind of be with the sad fact that Christmas season is over. And we return to a more normal time. But this is also good news for us because... The entire bit of Christmas, all of the anticipation and the decorating, we've been talking at Trinity about um, all the processes of welcoming a guest for all of Advent. But as we clean up and we put away all the sparkly things and all of everything else, we remember about what we talked about on Christmas Eve. Jesus' name is Emmanuel. God with us. And so often, God does not appear to us in big, sparkly, splashy kinds of moments, but God is with us in our every daily breath, in the food we taste, in the ways that we get joy when our cat or dog does one of those big stretches, and it's so cute. That is where God is, is in these ordinary, small joys. And when Jesus becomes a part of our everyday life, that's when we find the real joy of Christmas, that our life has been changed forever. And even though it may look ordinary, even though our homes and even the church goes back to normal, Jesus is still with us, and that hope and that joy is ours, and nothing can take it away. We have all the good feelings of Christmas, but we get to carry them into our next chapter, which is a beautiful gift from God. Amen.